Welcome to May. This is your general reading that will cover the general theme, the beginning, middle, and end of the month, the best part of the month, the biggest challenge, and then guidance and give you your crystal of the month that'll help you get through it um, as unscathed and as easy as possible, okay? It'll help you with all the things that you need. So um, this is for your sun sign. Career videos are gonna look like this and they'll come out soon. Um, so make sure you're subscribed and you hit the notification bell so you know when they come out. They are for your rising sign. This video right here will tell you um, why that is if you're not sure and then love videos come out halfway through the month and this is what they're gonna look like okay so let's get started if you're interested in what decks i'm using for this reading i've got the cosmic tribe tarot looks like this and then the angel prayers oracle by kyle gray um if you purchase them through the affiliate links down below i might get a couple cents which would be helpful in me continuing to make these videos because youtube pays you like I don't know, $20 a year. <laughs> um, but it doesn't cost you anything extra. So I would appreciate that if you're interested in buying a deck. And so, Scorpio, the general theme for the month for you is that you already know all the information that you're gonna have. You're not blocking anything from yourself. You know what you have to do. Okay, so you have all the knowledge that you're ever gonna have. So what does the beginning look like? The middle and then the end of the month. Um, so the beginning is like, okay, I have this knowledge on you know different things that are going on in my life and there's a challenge in front of me. Is it worth it or not? And so they're saying you don't have to feel like no matter what you choose based on the information you have, because it's time to choose, you have all the information you're gonna have, okay? Um, so whatever you're debating, they're like, you don't have to stick to that answer, though. You can change your mind later, no matter what it is. You know, even if you change career paths right now, you can always go back to what you used to do. Or, you know, maybe you decide you don't want kids, but then you can change your mind later. You know, whatever it is for you, th that's the beauty, right, of having free will. You can always change your mind. And so in the middle of the month, it's now going to be time to take action on whatever it is that you decide. And you're probably going to have to do it alone without a lot of support. But the thing is, is you have all the tools that you need and you're very organized. You're able to do whatever it is that you're having a hard time deciding on whether or not it's worth it. Um, so towards the end of the month, I don't feel like there's going to be a lot of people, um, you know, maybe reaching out in loving ways um, like they often do, but don't worry about this. It's not about you. It's not like your friends are abandoning you or anything like that. It's just more that they're wrapped up in their own life and stuff like that. And so they're saying, you know, this is not a time in which you just say, oh, well, you know, my friends and stuff that don't contact me, obviously it's because they don't value me. Like they don't, it's, it's not time to walk away from friendships just because things might seem a little distance. It's really not a, it's really not about you. So remember that at the end of the month. So what is going to be the best part of the month for you? Well, that things are not so ended as you might think. You know, in the beginning of the month, in the middle of the month, you're kind of thinking, okay, I need to make some choices here. And, um, you know, that whole concept of you can change your mind is really important. Um, don't give up on whatever it is that you decide. It's not time to walk away from and abandon whatever it is that you try, that you start, or you know, existing relationships. You're just not supposed to do that yet. What they're saying is like, good things are gonna come. There's gonna be happy memories from this time, which maybe it doesn't feel like that if a lot of you are struggling um, right now with the quarantine stuff. But they're saying everything's gonna balance itself out in the end and new beautiful you know, butterflies are gonna come out of this little you know, chrysalis that they were in. Wonderful things are going to come for you. And so that's the best part of the month. The biggest challenge for you is going to be you know, that you're healing in this process but you're on the way to getting everything that you've ever wanted. It doesn't necessarily seem that way right now, but as long as you're flexible and malleable, you can change course, just walk in the direction of your dreams. Now, for those of you who are thinking about starting a new business, um, it might be a good time to try that and it might be scary, right? Or maybe you think you need to learn more or know more first, but you're just gonna learn it as you go and that's the whole thing. Um, so. 
Good. Now, as far as your general overall guidance for this month goes, they're saying don't rely on your friends too much. And you know, some of them are not trustworthy and some of them aren't loving. But like I said, we might be making snap judgments towards the end of the month that that's the case for a lot of them when that's not actually true. Um, so there are some decisions that you're gonna have to go alone this month, but have faith that you can do it. They're saying like you have a lot of inner strength and inner power here. And so um, you get to co-create whatever it is that you're manifesting. And it looks like, I mean, they already told you, the best part is you can get all the things that you want. So just don't be afraid and change course to change course as you go along and be malleable and flexible as you chase whatever it is that you want for your life, okay? Your crystal of the month is Lapis Lazuli. And in the description box below, you can find a link to my blog page that'll tell you all about it and how to order one from me if you want or from somebody else if you want, or maybe you already have one, but um, it'll tell you exactly why you wanna pull that crystal out for your benefit this month. Love you.